Hey guys. Today we're trying Vane. Today we're loading Vane, as it were. <laughs> this one's been staring at me, taunting on my PS4 dashboard for a while, because I thought I might do a series on it, but then it's been now sitting on my desktop for like six months, I think, or more. But I guess a let's try it is. Let's give it a little preview. I think this one's going to take a bit after games like Journey and bound in games like that there's this like sort of artistic bordering on walking simulator with some light puzzles sort of beautiful third person cinematic games yeah oh boy oh boy yep 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 okay okay that's stressful that's immediately stressful uh i guess i'm not going that way anymore everything fell apart there goes the first plan. Shit. Looks like everything's like these rusty... like iron panels everywhere. There's like a storm tearing through. You know, like a wind vane. Oh god. Yeah, there's a wind vane. It's not doing so well. It's more of a propeller at the moment. Uh Is that like smoke or something? Oh. Everything over there is being like consumed by the goop. Oh god, I think it's getting closer. That's unpleasant. Oh! I don't know if you can fall on those or not. I'm tr tr trying not to find out the hard way. Okay, rude. Super rude. Kill that guy. Oh. Well, either we're dead or we're wished off to another world, like in Warriors of Virtue. We're going to go on a hero's journey style quest to fight our way back to our home or something. Load times aren't necessarily doing this game favors for its pacing. Uh oh, is it okay? Oh, no, there it goes again. <laughs> you worried me. Oh. Do I press a thing? Looks like it. Oh. I'm suddenly a bird. 
Expectations shattered. Okay, land. Tap, 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 tap. <laughs> Look at him hopping around. Oh, wow. Okay, you can really start going faster then. Where are we going? Any standout details out here? Oop. That's a nice looking bird. Look at that shimmer. That's where I'm supposed to go. Look at that color. Hold the circle is slow, I take it? Oh yeah, there's other birds here. Hey everyone. Just me, another crow. Just kind of chilling. What are you guys up to? Whoop. Try and go make some noise. Which is shown as a visual, visible shockwave. So definitely taking after journey a little bit here. What's up? Larger bird. Oh. Has everyone been brought here by these, like, seashell looking pendants? Oh, yeah, because I saw something shiny in the distance. That's what attracted me here. So it must have been these guys. God, they're free. We have to get them. That was a neat little mechanic where everyone landed with me. Where do they land? I'm looking for shinies. You wouldn't think they'd be able to carry on the, on the air like that. Oh, there's the vein. So you're probably an important location. Ball? Um... Oh. Oh, ah. Uh, didn't mean to do that. Not necessarily. Yeah, let's take some practice.
Please land again? Can you? Can you? Is that over? Here we go. How many of you can I can I get interested in ruining this thing? Oh, they're landing on. There was a bunch of them landing on the vein itself a second ago. Is that the trick? I can't tell if they're responding or not. Am I supposed to land on the wings? I'm not getting a lot of feedback right now. Okay, now they're flocking to spots. Um, does this matter or can I move on with my life? I can't really, where am I supposed to be going? Hmm. I mean, there's a shiny in there. I want to free the shiny, right? Here's where I get a little frustrated. Like, what do you want from me, game? You're not giving me a whole lot right now. A bunch of them landed, but then nothing happened. It just tells me, hey, press triangle. Like as if something's gonna happen when I do that. But then nothing happens when I do that. But like the ball didn't fall out, so we're not done yet, are we? It feels like we're supposed to get the ball to come out. Tried to land automatically. The c I feel like this is supposed to be over already. Like, I feel like this is supposed to be a really brief little segment that doesn't really stand up to that much scrutiny. The controls don't feel great. I don't feel like we already. I think playing as a, char as a human character is most of the game, probably. But they're going for something here, and I just I don't get it. Can I just leave? Maybe I can just leave? Find something else to do? There's another shiny, I guess. 
Maybe that was all the breaking I can do. Shiny. Oh, music's, music's kicking in. That's a good sign. wasn't necessarily intuitive, but I think I get it now. We're supposed to get more and more crows to show up from various sites by flinging the shiny at them. And that makes the, the, like, the squad grow, essentially. Any more shiny out there? Don't see any more necessarily. Yeah, I just launched a second group over here, so maybe that's enough people to do have enough weight. We need more birds. I didn't get the idea that we needed more birds because there was clearly more birds already there. I just couldn't get them to cooperate. So it wasn't really clear that I needed more birds because there was more birds. They just weren't landing. But how about now? Oop. So we're still not there, huh? So I guess I'd want to slowly rotate my camera and just look for another shiny. In the, in the distance. There's a shiny over there, but I think that's the one I already got because it's on the green land, but maybe it's not. It's hard to say. It seems too close to be the same one, but maybe I took a roundabout path here when it pointed me that way. This does look like a different layout layout. And there are some birds here, not a lot. There's like a whole temple here. The implication seems to be that no matter what direction we go in, the wind always points back towards the wind vane. Which is weird. It's like something supernatural is going on. I'm guessing a bunch of time has passed, right? Like, it seemed like we saw the fall of a civilization at some point in the past, and now we're seeing, like, the decrepit remains of that civilization as a bird. Show me your might, y'all. Yeah? Come on. Oh, just collapsed, man. I don't know where I'm gonna find a fourth one. Shit. Staring at the desert landscapes kind of hurting my eyes as I try to like spot a tiny, tiny shimmer somewhere. The reflections are pretty small.
I don't see anything. Which one's... Okay, there we go. You actually can't tell which bird is you sometimes if the camera doesn't follow you closely enough. But now it's kind of following me too closely. Maybe that's one? Can't tell if those are just like rocks or if that's another one of the things. It might just be a... like a tree in the desert. No. That one's shiny. Really helps with the controls when you're not even on screen. There we go. Ooh. Getting a decent bit of music here. Was that there before? I'm not sure if I remember that music being there before. But maybe it is every time. This is my fourth one, right? There's like four wings, basically. It's like, maybe that's it. I say hey, in a hopeful tone, just kind of wanting this to go somewhere. Oh, shit. Hey! I am the agent of destruction. Is that ball gonna have the character from earlier in it? Like in some kind of stasis? Am I getting killed right now? Because I feel like something bad's happening to Bird. Um. Hop, 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 hop. This will be, we'll be fine. This is fine. Uh oh. Was I always. Was the- was the bird always the girl? The, the other guy was wearing like a bird mask, like a plague doctor or something. Do we have this like relationship with these birds? Do we turn into them? Get out of there. You can do it. Here we go. Trying to move like a person. Hey, she does have a face.
Interesting use of silhouette there. Maybe they are bird people or something. So now I can wander the ruins of my civilization. This pulse thing is so trippy every time it happens. There are some really trippy things happening with the visuals. I would not be surprised if this is actually by the same people that made Bound. Because Bound had some really... That had its own stuff going on. You were like a... You were like a ballerina or something? Dancing their way through like a... Non-Euclidean paper craft universe? The low poly definitely seems recognizable. Did the vein collapse perfectly into like a... Platform I can use? I'm surprised none of the other birds were interested. Or are they just not people? What? Oh! What? Was I not supposed to climb that? I think I wasn't supposed to climb that. Or is there a maximum distance that I just covered? Where you turn back into a, a bird? Did I go the wrong way? I didn't really get a, a clear sense of what direction I was supposed to go in, but... That vein seemed like a decent start. I suppose those gi that giant door over there. This game has a lot of long trips across empty areas. That's one of the things that never quite get right. Like, there's also that one game where you played as a little boy on like a colorful island or something, and a robot and like a golem helps you sometime. I can't. I can't. It had another, like, similar one-word title that a lot of these have. I can't quite remember its name. It was like a white lighthouse. Something I've noticed that there's a lot of games that kind of visually get inspired by Journey. Same thing with the Spirit of the North, the Fox game I played like a week ago or something. But they never seem to capture the pacing Journey had. Journey has a beautiful pacing. Partly because I guess it was willing to be short in a way that some of these other games aren't seemingly willing to be. There we go. But that shortness was really nice. Because, like, it just kind of goes and goes and goes. It's like, Journey's actually really entertaining. And a lot of these games that take after Journey, while beautiful, and maybe even worthwhile, are often, like, just way more boring than Journey for long stretches. Whoa! See, now we're getting somewhere. I just went through the wall. Oh, this is beautiful. Look at this. These visuals are great. It's too bad that, like, two-thirds of the experience so far have been taken up by, like, sluggish, slow, trial-and-error gameplay where you try to figure out where to go. Because look how cool these visuals are. Oh my goodness, there's just like a giant grid of hanging bird cages that all have maybe people in them. Getting some like inside vibes. What a curious game. All right, well, that's a clean 30-minute mark endpoint loading screen, so I'm going to go ahead and call it there. But if you'd like to check out Vane, you can go download the game, 
via the link in the description. Thanks for watching like always, guys, and I'll see you next time.